Today we're going to be using a random game generator to decide which game I'm going to be platinuming today. Now there are some rules for this. It can't be just a game where I hit X a million times and get the platinum trophy. It can't be a game I've already played before or have any trophies on. And obviously the platinum has to be obtainable because if it isn't, I can't get it. So that wouldn't make sense. All right, so we're on the generator site. Click generate. Alec Hines Gun. Alec Hines Gun is a 2 out of 10 difficulty. It's one playthrough in eight hours. All right, so I'm gonna buy the game and install it. All right, so I purchased the game. It didn't take too long. It's only 60 gigabytes. Let me know if you guys have played this game before. I've never heard of it till now. Heard that it crashes, so we'll see. But I guess this is like a Hitman, but you're a CIA agent kind of. So like I said, this is a Hitman style game and I'm given tasks in each mission and my goal is to complete them stealthily. Now I'm aiming to get all the available trophies in one playthrough with the main one being the trophy called Legendary, which requires me to complete all 11 missions while only killing the main targets. Here I am on the first mission so you guys can see pretty much what the entire game is going to be like. And now my first objective here was to sneak into the castle. Alright so we made it inside the castle. What was my next objective? Well I'm glad you asked. My next objective was to eliminate Dr. Hans Heinrich. Alright so I'm in the torture chamber. Okay there's the doctor. What's up doc? Oh fuck. Uh dude it's not... It's not even that bad. Like, I'm into this stuff. Uh, it's not- Why are you- it's, I'm into this stuff. Alright, let's reload. If I'm gonna do that, I probably should take him away from the door first. Fuck! <laughs> Try and get this doctor into that closet and get his key and get his outfit before the bad guy comes in. God damn it. Um, I'm not overriding that save just in case I messed up because, um, I left the doctor just sitting there butt booty naked on the floor. After stealing the doc's identity and leaving him butt booty naked on the floor, I was called in to treat Martin Finkter. Doctor, I need you to take a look at me. This pain is killing me. Since you're such a great dude, I got you. Oh, you don't gotta be so violent with it. I think it'll do the job if you give it to him silent like. After a successful treatment for his pain, I took his clothes, went into his room, destroyed the tapes in his safe, and evacuated the premises. We're exiting through this. Once upon a time. Level one, completed. Deadly instinct, complete a level without using instinct mode. Predator, complete a level without using your gun. Contract killer, complete a level without killing except for assassination targets. Angel of Death. Complete all assassinations in a level using only accidents. I think there's like a better rating than professional and I did not get it because I had that body found. But I have that save file that I can use. All right, we're, we're back in this goddamn doctor's office, torture room, whatever you want to call it. And I am going to hide this body. Hey, we got it. Okay. All right, let's see if we get the trophy for getting the ghost like a ghost let's go now in level two i was going for a trophy called one suit man which pops if i complete a mission while using one disguise or less the disguise that i did end up choosing was the waiter outfit no need to worry i work here i'm just going to grab this baking soda and i'm going to add a little bit of my secret sauce to the wine now i'll give the wine to my customer i was serving which was you no it was you Godfather. Uh, how could I have forgot? Drink your wine. All right. You good? Are you good? What's wrong? See? What's the big deal? Hey, let's get the hell out of here before they find out I killed the Godfather. Mission complete, baby. Checked out. Level 2 completed. One suit man. Complete a level using one disguise or less. In the third level, I had the opportunity to obtain the trophy engineer, which requires me to perfectly execute this matching game. I don't know if it'll pop now or not. Engineer, perform a perfect rewiring during a sabotage puzzle. I gotta get out of here. R.I.P. Oh, is this where I beat the dude up? This is where I beat the dude up at. Hey, look at look at that. Look how things all tie together, you know? Again, it's like poetry, so if they rhyme. Now on to level four. I don't think I saved. No! After redoing level 3's ending, I went to level 4, completed it as well, and once again it was the same concept, eliminate two people and steal some documents. Mission complete! Deadly ending. Level 4 completed. Now while on level 5, I went for the trophy locksmith, which asked me to perfectly lockpick a lock with at least 4 locking mechanisms. Alright, so I will get a trophy if I pick this correctly. Locksmith. Sorry about it. Leave the place. Let's go. Abduction. Level five completed. After completing level five, the only trophies that I had left to obtain on my first playthrough were to beat the remaining levels. So here are some of my favorite moments while finishing up the levels. How's it going? 
Why aren't you into me? You guys just don't care that I just shot her? You're really that tired. Get up. You all right? Yeah, I'm fine. I mean, oh, yeah. what are you doing? They killed him. Let me take care of her. Okay, I got her. Please don't. Oh, whoa, hey, hey, hey. I just want to take her home. What do you want from me? All in card. Level six completed. Hey, I got to pick this lock. Yeah? What's wrong? Not in my house. <sighs> Cast away. Level seven completed. And I got to say, that was... Uh, Terrible level. Now I'm on level eight here doing my spy thing, but this guard right here is patrolling the place that I have to steal from. And remember how I can't kill anybody except for the main targets? Well, past Caleb made a noopsie here and didn't even realize it. You bastard! Oh, what's the matter now? I, d I don't even know what happened here. He was kind of just like chilling there. And I wasn't sure what was going on. You guys fucking idiots? What are you? I mean, okay, I gotta say the AI in this game is they're geniuses. Mission complete. Let's go. Goodbye, Colonel. Level eight completed. Wait, no. I killed two enemies and then I beat up the dude. I think I killed him. I must have killed the dude, I guess. I am pissing as well. We pissed together. That's how good of friends we are. Bro, are you guys stupid? You don't even care? Okay. Mission complete, baby. Let's go. Right here, I need to take out this officer so I can move into the next room and get my target. But once again, Alakine would not stop snapping necks. Stop snapping his neck. I'm going to say that didn't count as a kill. Don't mind me, just taking my pal Pearson home. Okay, this is like the final stretch of this mission. Imagine getting hit by that. You must be a dumbass. Mission completed. Public enemy. Level 10 completed. Enemies killed. Zero. All right. We're in the final mission. Right, so we're doing another throwing knife. Hey, who's there? I don't know. What happened? Somebody help. He's dead. Oh my God. He has a knife in his back. You guys think it could have been a heart attack? Oh shit. I'm gonna head out if they don't really care that I just murdered the man. Oh shit. There's a gun under the desk. Don't worry, I shot him with Alakine's gun. Da -da -da. Peace. Level 11 completed. All right, I'm back in chapter eight. After reviewing the tape, this was the only guy that I killed. If those guards would have did their job and caught me, I would have had to reload because I'm the only one in there with a dead body. You bastard. Somebody help. He's dead. What? He's not dead, you liar. Okay, well, if he is dead, I have a save right before I supposedly killed him. I think that's a little exaggeration. Even with how addicted Alakine is to snapping necks, he did not snap that dude's neck. Legendary, let's go. Complete game without killing except for assassination targets. Interesting grammar. This trivia right here wants me to hide 30 bodies. And while I probably hit about 10 in my playthrough of the game, you got to complete all 30 in the same session. Game crashing or closing the game would reset your streak. And this goes for the 30 kill trophies I'll be doing later as well. 31. Hide 30 bodies. There's also a trivia that wants me to get the lowest rating possible, so I play the game how I normally would. All right, so I have a little pile of bodies right there, and I hope I finish with the Maniac rating, because I've killed a couple people. Now, just for good measures, I'm gonna save here. I'm gonna try and just shoot a bunch of people before I leave. I don't know if it'll let me leave, though. Okay, let me leave. Maniac, let's go. Obtain Maniac ranking on a level. Now here I am going for the 30 headshot trophy. Wow, what a great epic headshot. Then the trophy, go for the throat, which requires me to garrote 30 enemies. All right, this could either be 29 or 30. It's looking like it's 29. Oh, it's 30. Garrote 30 enemies. Now I need to chloroform 30 enemies. All right, we'll say that's 29, you know? Hey, optimistic. It is, let's go. Sleeper agent, use chloroform on 30 enemies. All right, so I'm in chapter four. I'm going for the trophy chameleon. It's the final trophy that I need and it's to acquire 30 different disguises. Finishing the game, I had about a little bit over 20 disguises. I think they saw me change. So just use mechanics clothing. I'm gonna need your clothes, bucko. Damn, I look like a badass. They're trying to foil my plan by trapping me in the goddamn door. I need your outfit. Now I'm chef. 
Guard's outfit. There's a couple more in this chapter if I, this one doesn't count. Waiter's clothing. Let's go. All right, you guys can see the counter, but I had no clue how many outfits I had in total. So right here, I was looking for the masseuse outfit, which ended up being my last outfit I needed. Over here. Hey, it is. Okay, that's some masseuse clothing. Put it on, put it on. Let's go. Chameleon. No. And I am Alakine. Obtain all trophies. Guys, guys, I got the platinum. Why are you shooting at me? No, it's over. I'm done. I got the platinum. All right, here's my final verdict on the game. Did I have a good time? Yes. Did I enjoy killing the armed forces of the Third Reich? Yes. But there was a lot of issues, including audio and visual glitches. And the story was just okay. So my final rating for this game will be a 35 out of 100. Just so everyone knows, this is a personal rating. You may or may not enjoy the game more than I did. All right, that's it for Alakine's gun and letting this website pick a random game for me to platinum. I hope you guys did enjoy. Hope you're having a good day, night, evening, morning, afternoon, breakfast, lunch, dinner. Wherever you're at, whatever you're doing, have a good one.